gonna use his fists? Oh, hands only. I mean, this could give him give him a really big like power boost. Let's see if he's up for it. Whoa! Whoa, dude! This is different. <laughs> He's still got to do the daily quest, too. Here we go, baby. What will it be? Whoa. Oh, no. Oh, my God. He's locked in here until he completes it. And he can't use any healing. It's just one big corridor. That's sketchy. What is going to be waiting for him in here? Knights. We saw that big red knight. That's clearly the boss of the dungeon. It's got to be waiting for him all the way in the back. This is the first type of like knight or armored enemy he's faced. And these things are not going to be able to be punctured by his daggers. The poison won't work on these guys. They're fast too, dude. He can't get through the armor. This is going to be so bad. And this is just one of the grunts. Even his strength isn't working. There we go. There we go. So he's going to have to like actually get his hands on them. His weapons aren't going to work. And he had to use Fatal Strike. I was about to say, he's going to have to save that. Because there's a ton of them. Okay, he's managing his own in here. But the more mana he uses, the more skills he has to use in here. Yo, one of these things had a stealth skill. <laughs> this place is different. And like a knight assassin. And there's mages too. Each of these enemies has a specific type of weakness that he has to try to exploit. Yeah, those guys are the problem. They can attack from long range. And that's one of his low stats, intellect. The more he expels now, the less he's going to have. Oh, this is bad. His fatigue is going up. It's over halfway to 100. Whoa! We got Mr. Fancy Pants and all the, the big wig hunters. All the big shots up here. Is he finally going to try to, to go back to the island? Oh, he can take their armor. Yeah, that's the one thing he hasn't really used. He hasn't really tried on any type of armor. Oh, that's sick. It turns invisible. <laughs> He's about to be kitted up then. Like, boost his agility, his perception. At least he's getting some good rewards from these guys. You know, when you see these big fancy doors, it's going to be bad news. Ooh, look at this ambiance. Oh, yeah, it's about to go down in this room. It's a throne room. Oh, this is a... This is such a cool place for a final fight. Here we go. No way! The same level of pressure for the, from the double dungeon? We got this Scarlet Knight. He is looking mighty. Igris the Blood Red. And that means he's a higher level than he is. Even after all his training. Oh, look at the aura of this dude. Oh my god, he's got a crazy dash skill. <laughs> oh my god, he can cut through pillars. Like, with no wasted effort. 
This is another fight where immediately Sung is outmatched. And without being able to heal. He might have to use his teleportation stone. It's not even giving him a second to react between strikes. It's moving like a boxer. He's gonna have to use his strength. Oh. Yo, the animation going crazy as well. Look at this, like the red electricity. He can match Sung in speed, but he's got more juice to him. Yo, look at how good this looks. He's gonna use his fists! Oh, hands only! No weapons needed! Is he gonna match him? Oh, oh, what a flex, dude. Yo, he really put down his weapons. They gotta be careful, man. Like, from what we first saw, it looked like there was just a swarm and swarm of enemies. Third time's the charm, I guess? I can't believe this thing is going to take him on now without his sword as well. He said, if you're not going to use weapons, I don't need weapons either. <laughs> nah, this dude Igris is crazy. He's just beating him into the wall. Look at the power behind his fists. Those strikes are doing crazy damage. Oh, look at those bruises. And that's with the armor on. Yeah, this level of power just from his hands is is nuts this dude's the mike tyson of, of final bosses he's gonna boost his speed here we go dude igris isn't even reacting to him he does not care come on son let's go baby it feels like he's behind yo this is so clean this is everything, dude. Every boss fight in this show is so goaded. He just still can't keep up. He has yet to get even one hit in. It's all defense, even with this speed boost. First hit. Oh my god, it did nothing. <laughs> He's toying with him. Oh my god. He's just throwing him around like he's a rag doll. He's hitting him with Street Fighter combos. Oh, he landed on the throne. He's going in for the final blow. Sung is so cooked. Not like this. He caught the sword. Oh my god. Let's go! He's not giving up! Try to catch him off guard! Right in the eye! He finally dealt damage! He got it in between where his armor could block! Using everything he has left! Look at the willpower! Oh, it'll go right back to him! A second strike! Another one! He's gotta hit him more! He's dealing damage! Yo, this is stupid! Look at how this looks! This is another level! All those fatal strikes! Oh my god, he did. I don't know how he keeps digging deep for these, dude. That was very, very lucky. That without that armor, he would not have been able to catch that. 
So what does he get from this as a reward? Okay, so a ton of cash. He gets an S-ranked helmet. He gets the helmet. Oh, that's so cool. That's like the highest level of gear he's gotten up to this point. And it gives him a big defense boost. We'll have to see what type of skill that is. Instant teleportation stone. What is the purpose? Oh my god, it's not over? You're, you're kidding me. You're joking. You're joking! It's like a survival one! Oh my god, he goes as long as he can to get as many rewards as possible. Oh my god, he's got waves! There's so many. So how long is he gonna try to survive for? So he's just gonna try to stall time. Oh, he does not have a lot of uses left. What is that? What is that? It broke the stealth skill. That's broken as hell. He better get something crazy from this. This is not a level he can win. Oh, big damage. Look, five minutes isn't bad. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ooh. Yo, why is he so good at losing teleportation stones? Oh, this is about to be a disaster. Here they come. Sung, what are you supposed to do? What a hype episode, you guys. Like, that was so awesome. From the fight with Igris to just, like, the waves of the armored knights coming in. Like, so much fighting. Just straight up throwing hands with all these enemies in this job change quest. And we see Sung now be exposed to a different type of a challenge. A time-based wave challenge at the end. Where he doesn't even know what type of rewards are on the table for him. And he basically goes until he can't go anymore. It's not something that's designed to be, you know, quote unquote beatable. It's never ending. Like he got some crazy rewards from defeating Igris. He got his helmet, which is going to be just a such a useful item for him to be able to have now. But what is the purpose of this? It, it's super, super interesting how he had to face this type of a challenge. But we got to talk about that battle against Igris, man. That was so incredibly epic. That was easily, you know, the strongest opponent that Sung has faced up to this point. And his victory was kind of fluky. Like, he was right. Yeah, I could argue that he should not have won that. Without that armor that he had, he would not have been able to catch the sword and then catch him off guard. Like, he was so winded and he used up so much energy. And it makes me wonder if some of these higher up level challenges and dungeons are going to have restrictions like this place in that how he can't you know use a full recovery or restore his his mana or his health so in situations like that he's really gonna have to be careful and frankly i don't know how he's gonna get out of this he's got to find a way to get back to that teleportation stone so we're gonna have to find out what happens next time i do think it's also really interesting though that the higher-ups at the hunters association and of these different guilds are going back to Jeju Island to try to kind of right the wrongs of their past failures. Like that place is just on another level. You can't go in there and be cocky and be rash. And I just, I just don't think this operation is going to go very well. But we'll have to see you guys. Let me know what you thought of this episode down in the comment section down below. And as always, you guys, I mean the world to me if you would like and subscribe. This would help me out a ton. Finally caught up on solo leveling, y'all. And the new episode comes out in just two days. So I am hype. And this means I can get back on the bleach grind. But until next time, y'all, take care. Have yourselves a great day, everybody. Peace.